How's it going YouTube? My name is Stan. Uh, I don't even have a DJ name yet. That's how much of a beginner I am. But today I'm going to show you how to set up your Newmark mix track and the DJ IO onto your computer so you can play to the crowd on your speakers and also cue up the songs on your headphones. Okay, first what we're going to do is go through the equipment that I have and all the uh, necessary tools that you're going to need. Um, so you can better follow. All right, first uh, is the Newmark Mix Track, not to be confused with the Newmark Mix Track Pro. Next, I have the Newmark DJIO. This actually came in a package deal um, with the Newmark Mix Track. Uh, it was 168 bucks at on eBay.com, and it was a great deal, so I had to get it. Uh, this also comes with an installation CD, so make sure you <clears throat> install it on your computer first. Another very important thing you need is your laptop or your computer, uh, whichever holds the program. Uh, usually the Newmark Mix Track comes with a program, uh, either Tractor LE or Virtual DJ LE. Um, my computer already had the uh, Pro, so uh, I'm just going to use the Pro. Up next is my computer speaker. There's one over here and there's one over there. And under this very messy table is actually the... Um, my subwoofer so both these speakers right here are actually connected to the subwoofer under this table and um, both speakers and the subwoofer are powered by this jack right here it is one eighth of an inch uh, jack so just keep that in mind up next I have my headphones um, it has a very long wire no pun intended and at the end of this is also a one eighth of an inch jack and also keep that in mind. A couple other things that you're gonna need is a RCA female to male splitter. Okay, this is a female, um, obviously, hence the hole. And this hole is actually one quarter of an inch. Um, okay, and it splits into the two males, uh, one red and one white. And just keep in mind that the hole is one quarter of an inch. Also, we have two adapters. And basically what this does, it, it converts the um, one eighth inch jacks to one quarter inch jacks. Uh, just keep in mind, this is a stereo uh, adapter. Um, you don't want to buy the wrong one. I'm also going to show you how to hook up the mic uh, to the DJIO. If you don't have a mic, that's uh, no big deal. Um, it's just an extra. Okay, so let's get started. First, what I'm going to do is hook, set up, or hook up my um, Newmark mix track to the laptop. Um, just keep in mind that this is USB powered, obviously. So here it is, right here, on um, the USB port, right here, to the Newmark mix track, and I'm just going to hook it up to my laptop right on the side. And there it is. There you go, and that lights up the Newmark mix truck like a Christmas tree. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to take my uh, Newmark DJIO and this comes with a USB uh, cord just like this and we're going to hook the USB cord up to the back on the USB um, right here. So we're going to do that. And uh, at the end of it is another USB port, so I'm going to hook that up to my computer right over here, just like that. Uh, this DJIO also lights up when you hook it up. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to actually gonna hook up the splitters, the female to male splitter, um, these, the red and the white wires, into the back of the Newmark DJIO. So here it is here's your output one right here and you want to hook it up over there you can also hook it up to the output two but i like to hook it up to the uh, output one so obviously the red goes into the red and the white goes into the white so red goes into the red and the white goes into the white now um just to be clear the output one is basically what you're going to be playing to the crowd so what you're going to be hooking up to the female um, or the end of this is what you're going to be playing to the crowd in my case it's going to be my computer speakers next what we're going to do is we're going to hook up my speakers to the back of the DJIO 
and um, this both speakers again is powered by this 1 8 inch jack so what we first have to do is actually um, convert it into a one quarter inch with our adapter so I'm gonna take one of the adapters just like that and I'm going to plug it in hope I could do it with one hand there you go now I've just converted the one eighth jack into a one quarter inch jack and basically what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna plug it into the output one which is right here which is gonna be plugged into right here just like that. Next what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my headphones right here. I'm going to unravel it or whatever. And the headphones is actually a uh, there it is. A 1 8 inch jack as well. So we also have to um, convert that into a one quarter inch with our second adapter which is right here so I'm going to do that right now it's really hard to do with one hand no pun intended <clears throat> all right and then we're basically gonna hook this up to the headphone slot on the new mark DJIO which is right here it's all worded for you so I'm gonna hook that up to the side of it right there There you go. Just like that. Now this is for everyone that has a mic. Uh, at the end of my mic is a one quarter inch jack already so we don't have to convert that or anything. It's already converted for you. And that actually hooks up to the mic input right here or the output rather. And that goes into the hole right there. Just like that. Oh, okay, and this knob right here actually controls the volume of the mic um, To the right it goes higher to the left it the volume goes down Okay, there you have it you have now successfully connected your uh, Newmark mix track and your uh, Newmark DJIO to the speakers and your headphones and the laptop um, So you can play your music to the crowd while you're also uh, queuing up a song all right, so there's only one more thing that you have to do, and that's actually configure your virtual DJ to uh, play on the speakers and the Newmark mix track. Um, so how you do that is, uh, okay, you just, here we go. And for all of you that have Tractor LE, I apologize. I don't know. I don't have that program, so I'm sorry. I don't know how to um, configure that. Um, so sorry for the poor quality as well. Um, you just go to configurations right here on the top right, and this is what you're going to see. All right, so here's my arrow, and all right, on the input setting right here, uh, there is a drop tab menu, but you actually leave it at none. All right, and then on the outputs right here, uh, you're going to go to the drop down menu, and you're going to hit headphones. All right, and then on the sound card. What you're going to do is you're going to go down to the drop drop down menu and you're going to hit ASIO driver. Just like that. Now, to the right, there's also another drop down menu. Uh, make sure that uh, in that area right here, it says Newmark USB audio device. If it doesn't, make sure you go down to that drop down menu right there and click on Newmark USB dev uh, audio device. Now, uh, keep in mind that this right here, this uh, was not checked when I first uh, hooked up my Newmark mix track and the DJIO. Um, you might want to check that only because the 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 sound quality of the music that you're playing um, might actually sound a lot better. So make sure you check that. Play with it a little bit. See uh, which one sounds better. So I have mine checked. All right, I'm going to go ahead and hit apply and then I'm going to go ahead and hit OK. And there you have it. That's how you do it. I hope this helped you. Uh, this is my first how-to video, so uh, please show me some love.